Go Mega Man. Right, Go I'm too far into the season. I'm staying Three. Uh, Fancy Army is trying to go home, and then I might have to step off. Cause I'm actually, anyway, game one. <laughs> we got Lucky Win versus Brownie for Grands. Uh, it's actually Brownie coming from losers, and Lucky Win did winners. Yeah, Billy actually beat him in uh, in uh, winners. So. So uh, that's backwards. Hmm. Yeah. But uh, anyway. Oh, he gimped him. Anyway, Brownie off to a very nice start after getting Lucky Win off of the stage and just constant, just kept on pushing at him. But Lucky Win answering with a spike <laughs> to bring it down to one Billy, stock of you're so at 0%. good. <laughs> oh, that was beautiful. Down throw, F tilt. And if you're Lucky Win here, you're really going to want to stay on the stage and keep Shulk above you. Because you can just rack up all the flat aerials. But um, if you're Shulk, you want to ideally get flat off of the stage here. Yeah. But lucky win right now, getting a good, getting good damage. Up air, it's another up air. Yeah, and Brownie able to land there because lucky win tried to push charge and limit just a yeah. little bit. Brownie had just enough time. But uh, lucky win. Taking the stage a bit, getting some limit off of that. But uh, uh, I was going to say very, very, nice, there. very nice response to the backslash there to just throw up the shield. You could easily just get that forward tilt forward punish and get Brownie off of the stage again. But uh, yeah. Brownie elected to go for Ooh. the shield and that forward smash. Yeah, gonna F smash is going to do it. Yeah, um, Shulk's F smash is pretty strong. This matchup is actually pretty interesting. Cause yeah, it was a very fast game one. That was, like, especially their first stocks. Billy, if you just F smashed but instead K2, of F2. We're going to be going to Battlefield as, a, as per Lucky Win's pick. Yeah. And this could, I feel like this is a good stage for both characters. We know it's all, like really good for Cloud. Oh yeah, it's really good for Cloud and, it's, and uh, Brownie also enjoys this stage. Oh yeah, it does seem like one of those stages where if you have really large hitboxes, you can thrive on like other people trying to stand on the platforms. Yeah. Like, I'm, a, I'm more of a doubles player, so I actually see like, a lot of team attack instances happen with Cloud, with characters like Cloud on this stage, and also Dreamland to some extent too. But uh, like it when getting limit, yeah, having limits really good in this matchup because you can like contest with speed and uh, jump Monado because jump Monado is uh, the best has the best aerial mobility in the game, and then number two is Cl limit Cloud. Yeah, and so. Lucky Wind is not the type of player who's going to just throw out his That limit. was good. Of course, as I say that, he gets the limit he cross slash and picks off cross Brownie's slash. recovery. So very nice there by Lucky Wind. Yeah. Schult, Schult kind of does have a little bit of the same problem Cloud does with a uh, not being able to snap to ledge. Um, so you can just kind of just throw out a limit cross slash like that, and it'll hit. Oh, yeah, he's dead. Yeah, but Cloud also having that problem. Oh, he's got limit. Oh. No, he killed himself. Billy. He could have actually grabbed the ledge there, but Brownie was actually going to be able to get a hit off because Lucky One had actually missed the ledge. Yeah, he missed the ledge when he went down. It's harder. It's weird snapping the ledge with limit up B when you're like coming down because you have to like space it perfectly. And you wouldn't think that because most players will actually just snap it That's from below and just have it. Yeah. But it's another thing when you're actually trying to go high with it. Yeah. Getting the up air there on shield. Yeah, does a lot of just trying to get himself onto the ground there too. Yeah, it does a lot of shield pressure. I think if Billy gets, it, yeah, that's good. And now if Billy gets limit here, he's around like limit cross slash percent. Yeah, we're even uh, play beam off of the stage too. Like Lucky Wind has a lot of tricks with limit. It's not just gonna be always cross slash. Yeah. Oh dang. Down throw. Up air. Yeah, going into the shield, Monado being safe. And that's probably going to prompt Lucky Win to hang on to limit just a little bit longer unless he is like absolutely sure that he has something. Yeah, he's got to be safe on or, the ledge here. Brownie's yeah, really that's good at burn the limit right there. He's just going to try to like fair him, get him back off. Down smash. Oh. Yeah, right now Lucky Win just needs to get Brownie off of the stage to at least get some of that pressure off. Because yeah, he the just smash isn't really quite going to do it, I don't think. 
Yeah, he just needs to get himself one man back right now. <gasps> oh, he air dodged, yeah. Yeah, air dodge. Gonna be pretty much the reason that he doesn't hit a B again to get back two to like to have to get like that. And that might have been a panic response because it looks like that forge match was actually gonna just send him out and not. Yeah, he might have been buffering roll too. Yeah. That is a 2 0 in Brownie's favor right now. Yeah, Billy, you spaced the up B wrong. Yeah, the up B where you went like went down? No, you couldn't. You were, you were too low. You were too close to the light, yeah. Yeah. Billy being a cloud scrub and not knowing his character where he can snap the ledge. And Cholk is one of those characters that, like, like publicly you don't see a whole Ooh, lot. Billy went Fox. So. I do like the Fox switch from Lucky Win because the cloud has not been working out. He's been having some issues getting back onto the stage when he doesn't have a limit because Brownie has been able to abuse that road like very consistently. So I do like the Fox switch. Yeah, Billy Billy did go Fox today against uh, Jigs Pikachu because like he got he just got gimped as Cloud and I was just like oh no I gotta go Fox. And the Fox was a good pick, and he got the reverse 2 0. I watched that set too from the side. Yeah, it was an interesting set. Yeah, but right now, Brownie's going to be the one struggling to land as Lucky Wind is getting with these uh, strings that are just keeping Brownie up in the air. And Shulk is definitely a character that you can, de you can get in his face here and there. Yeah. Like, as, if you're absolutely sure that you're not going to get vision countered, like, you need someone that you can take a string and just not worry too much about some of the consequences that could happen. But, no, he jumped into that up smash there. Yeah, a little scared there. Like, because I thought it was going to be like Cam and then just side B to the stage, just off the ledge. Get in the upper there. Some good damage. It's a good way by Lucky Wind as he saw that other up air coming. Up tilt. Oh, not quite getting the up air, misfacing it. Up tilt. Almost got the back air. Oh, went for the fair pussy. Oh, that was a great yeah, tech. Very nice tech by Lucky Wind. Able to survive that down air, and Brownie is going to lose his stock as a result. And. Not having that stock could be really huge if Lucky Wind is able to swing the momentum back into his favor, but right now, Brownie is just all over him at the moment. That's a commentator's curse. Yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, and there uh, it is. He, yeah. doesn't, he doesn't tech that one, and that's going to be a 3 0 yeah. and bracket reset already. Yeah, just like the fastest thing in the world. Yeah. You have the bracket reset. Grand Finals. Mm -hmm. Like, feels like I got here about you, what, five minutes ago? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he's going back to Cloud. Smart pick. And yeah, now they're both in losers. Yeah, the, the Fox game was a much faster game, but it just like the strings that he was getting just wasn't enough to get all the momentum back into his favor. He was getting a little bit here and there, but again, not enough. Yeah. So Billy or Lucky Wind is gonna have to pick his poison here. Yeah, but it's basic neutral right now. Just Cloud kind of out framing him. Uh, getting the cross slash, that's good. Oh, going for the back slash there. <laughs> I love how he punishes. He got hit. Or you get punished for hitting your opponent. Oh, that was a little cross slash. Oh. Actually, I don't know if that would kill there. Yeah, you gotta be safe there. Using limit. Snap yeah, ledge. it's gonna be a, like a very nice Good win there for Brownie in that bout because now Lucky Wind is gonna have to try and get his limit all over again. Lucky Wind elected to wait this time. Yeah. And yeah, because those hitboxes oh, linger so hard to a point where it's like, you can't even be sure that a ledge attack is actually gonna get through to that. Yeah, but right now, Lucky went up a stock, doing pretty good. And uh, Brownie's in a, a Smash Monado, so. 
Everything does more. It looked like it's stage, stronger. but he is going to have to burn lemon to get back on, too. Yeah, I noticed Billy is jumping a lot from the ledge. He's got to be safe with that because um, Brownie can just kind of like up tilt it. <laughs> Another backslash. Oh, there, Lucky went actually recovering low enough to the point where he actually does not get board smashed. Good cross slash. I would say run away and get Lemon right now while he's trying to like, oh, get grabbed. Yeah, yeah it's going to do it. Yeah, and Smash Monado, that is actually going to be pretty strong. Yeah, Smash Monado down throw and back throw are like his best kill throws. Really his only kill throws, actually. Ooh. Now, now it's going to be some problems for Lucky Wind as he came back onto the stage. Brownie only getting about 25 onto Lucky Wind for it, though. That was good fair. Yeah, but Brownie's doing a really good job at just keeping Lucky Wind off the stage for as much as he possibly can. Yeah. It was like, this is a really, like, ledge trapping matchup. Like, um, Lucky Wind is a really good, really good at ledge trapping, and um, so is Brownie. Especially with Clouds. Like, he, he can really just, like, bear at the ledge yeah. and it'll kill him. And, Lu and Lucky Wind actually being pretty smart there, not going too deep, so I just have to use up his limit. Ooh, dang, got in that one weird hit. But but very nice read by Lucky Wayne to get the, yeah. the ledge option there. Yeah, and Billy took game one of uh, set two, grand finals. And that's going to be a really nice one for Lucky Wayne, because in the second set, he got 3 0 in the first one. Yeah. So he's... And that's going to be what he needs to build his momentum off of. He's got the something to light that spark, and he's going to need to keep it going from here on out. If he's yeah. going to take this grand finals from Brownie. 19% cross slash, getting some up air juggles now. Shulk does struggle with landing in that. <gasps> Billy, you're so good! That forward smash, very quick first stock, and suddenly. Oh my god! Lucky one has all the momentum now. Yes, Lucky Wind has so much momentum right now. It's just crazy. Yeah, yeah I figure after taking that game one, after game three, he's got to be feeling himself now that he's got something to actually work with. And, and Cloud up seems to have been the way up to go. He's not going to yeah, do it. No, he, had, he didn't have enough rage. Calm down there, Lucky Wind. <laughs> yeah. Like, that was definitely true, but he didn't have enough rage. Like, with rage, that would have worked. That would have killed. Yeah, I don't know. I don't. I, back air missed him. And it, and it, ew. Yeah, weak up air and up air and back air. Yeah, one of the toughest things about trying to land on the stage when Cloud is right below you is oh, hey. you get the air dodge. Back Let's Very go, nice Billy. Up 2 0. Yeah, is that even if you get the air dodge, there's a lot of lingering oh. Cloud's aerials. Or even if he waits, like, he can just do like a quick neutral air and comes out fast enough. Or even up air. Okay. And now all of a sudden, very quick 2-0 in Lucky Wind's favor in the second set. Oh yeah, go back to Smashville. All these games have been ending incredibly fast too. Oh yeah, because Lucky Wind got that crazy zero to death at the beginning. It was a good down air, 15, or no, he was on the ground, so that was 14. <gasps> He's that, yeah, was so, that was so, that was so good. After getting vision there. Fair, dare, oh. Getting limit from the down throw, though. Uh, tried get him. Tried, tried, tried catch to catch him there, but did not. Yeah, didn't quite get him. I want to see a bit more limit camping from Billy, though. Because this, this is a good matchup for limit camping. Be careful, yeah, there you go. Like, I would definitely use that time when uh, Brownie is off of the stage, too. Yeah. Yeah, that smashable platform really saved him there. Yeah, and it was very much needed because it was oh, either no. that or he was going to have to deal with that board smash. Ah, oh, he could have charged limit. Brownie then. just carrying that all the way into getting the first stock off of Lucky Wind here in game three. Yeah. Billy could have charged limit there because he was at like three quarter charged and then just kind of up beat back, but nah, he, I guess he misjudged it. So. Quick grab by Brownie there, and now Lucky went off of the stage and oh, he yeah. was out of his double jump there too. That was so. that could have been it if he didn't space that right. Oh my 
Chaos just running away and charging Limit. Yeah, Lucky Wind isn't really going to have a whole lot of time to charge Limit while Shulk is in the speed Monado because he can just run right up to yeah, him. Yeah, just really like, like rushing him down and then... And you'll get a tiny sliver of charge at best. Fortunately for Lucky Wind, this tiny sliver is all he needed. Oh. Uh, Could have finished this. Ooh, he gets across Ew, last, but, but Shield Monado kicks yeah, in. Yeah, he just barely got Shield Monado. Oh, getting the up smash there. That was a good up smash. Yeah, reading that roll and punish him for it. He does have now rage, he, and rage is big for Cloud because he can just do and some. He's also going to be very close to having limit, so Brian yeah. is going to like to go with the smash. I, th I think, I think he's probably going to start looking for like a normal cross slash, get a good 19%, and then start doing some juggling. Get him to about 30, and then he'll be. Get him, yeah. Uh, Ronnie's option, yeah. Well, gonna she's, do yeah, the, she's a smash that, and she's trying to end it as soon as possible. 70 something. Yeah. A very nice job to end for by Brownie to end it that quickly right then and there before Lucky Wind even had a chance to get another limit. Oh yeah. Yeah. Going to uh Brownie thinking, I don't want to deal with this rage, so I'm just gonna take him out. Yeah. Smash Monado. Going to Battlefield. It's a good pick for uh Lucky Wind. Devin also enjoys this stage. Alright, so game four here. And So really quick back and forth, but favoring Lucky Wind a little bit until he gets off the stage. But now that he is off the stage, some pressure is going to be on him because Brownie can cover a lot of space with just his attacks alone. Fair. Ooh. Well, Lucky Wind possessing it damage lead at the current moment. Oh, man. And dropping it goes buster mode. The commentator's curse is just real with me right now as the lead just goes back to the brownies' favor. Yeah, and that forward smash, smash is going to not do it. Oh, wow, that was real close. Uh, trying to protect yeah. the ledge with the limit blade beam. Yeah, but he used up he used up that limit so he couldn't get back yeah, up I don't, there. I don't think that's the best he option. Was, he was going to have to use up the limit anyway, though, before the recovery. Yeah, so the difference is snapping the ledge versus not snapping the ledge. And now Lucky went down to his last stock in game four. Oh, yeah, definitely. Like, this could be just a quick gimp right here, right now. Is uh, Lucky Wind is on the ledge, which isn't the best spot to be against Brownie. I mean, Lucky Wind is a lot. Up to like, he's there. going for a lot of attack where Brownie is instead of where he's going to be. So Brownie's just been able to move out of the way a lot, especially when he's in the more mobile Monados. Yeah, especially like Speed Monado, Jump Monado. Oh, oh very unfortunate SD by Brownie there Brownie with the backslash. SD. The Pulling off the For Glory Shulk SD. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just in the cloud can get some shenanigans. The only thing more hilarious than that okay, is the he's little Mac he's, Wait, no, no, no. Yeah, hold on. Yeah, he's at per se. Billy, I want Billy yeah, to be re It's a really huge deal now that Brownie is out of Smash Monado because now... Yeah, the oh, Monado Purge going to game five. Didn't really matter too much, though, because he lands the really high up up air, and it's actually enough to force a game five here. Oh, yeah. So a possible reverse 3-0 can happen from Brownie. Definitely. So this next game is going to decide the tournament and who gets first place. And who's going home with less money than the other person. Yeah. And we're going back to Battlefield. Back to Battlefield, yeah. Smart pick for and Billy. I, and I should also point out that Brownie's only death... Uh, yeah, Brownie's death in the last game was that for Lori Shulk SD. So, yeah. And which mean, which pretty much means he's not going to let that happen again. Oh yeah. And he's in no position to let that happen again. <laughs> yeah, but very nice running off of the stage by Brownie there, and then coming back on to to hit Lucky Wind or something, using the mobility. From jumping out of there. Yeah, up air into another up air. Yeah, but now Brownie off the stage and out of his jump. Ah, uh, lucky went unable. Isn't that? Ah, no, Billy. Yeah, unable to close it out there as Brownie does get some good spacing to grab that ledge. But, uh, I'm, I'm not sure how I feel about the yeah the decision for Smash Monado. Good switch there. Yeah, he probably messed lucky, up. Yeah. 
it didn't seem intentional. Lucky Wind was at a fairly lowish percent, and Shulk would, would have been in a lot of danger from getting. Oh wow, that's the first time we've seen there. neutral get up from uh, Lucky Wind there, but the Monado purge almost doing it. And Brownie going for Whoa. the shield Monado here. Yeah, this is a good time where you can just kind of like sit back, get limited. Yeah, th yeah, this does allow Lucky Wind, but he only needed a tiny sliver left, so. <gasps> oh, that was good. Yeah, that, yes, he lived. Yeah, it's going to force the limit there. Oh, that was good. That was good. C covering the ledge, gotten a good 19% from the blade beam. And I should also point out, he was going to have to use limit anyway. So uh, he got the damage really. for it and was still able to get back onto the stage. So very nice decision there by Lucky Win. Oh, the air slash piece tech. No, Billy. Uh, no tech from Lucky Win there. As he got a little greedy going off the stage there. And he's going to start getting punished uh, constantly if he's going to continue attacking into Brownie's shield and not being safe about it. As Brownie's getting a lot of out of, pu out of shield punishes against Lucky Wind here. And the momentum going back into Brownie's favor now as he's getting hit after hit against Lucky Wind Dang. here. And Lucky Wind not even able to get that stock off. The more percent he takes, the worse it gets. I mean, that's obvious. Itself. Wow. If he tilted that, he tilted that down. Uh, if, they, if he tilted that F smash yeah. like normally. Yeah. And that, oh. Now we're looking at like a. There we go, that's the blade beam. Yeah, that's gonna okay. And now, now we're looking at a possible like smash Monado kill here. Oh no. Billy's on the ledge. Oh! oh. <laughs> Covering. Oh. Yeah, covered in the ledge there is going to end the tournament and the reverse 3 0. Very nice by Brownie. Great games. Yeah, and he got the untechable yeah. thing too. Yeah, so. there just was not much that Lucky One could have done about that. Yeah, so that was close.